Hello, everybody. I messed up my OBS scene already. Like, oh my god. I, oh, oh, I switched over it. Oh, Are you on mute? Uh, no, 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 we're unmuted. We're, oh, okay. we're, we're live now. And it's like, oh my god. All right. Hey, everybody. Hi. Oh, actually, Hi. I should bring up the, the chat. I'll, I'll take it down like once we start our actual <laughs> challenge game just to prevent like any, any, uh, any screws. Uh -huh. But I want uh -huh. to say hello to everybody. Hey, everybody. Welcome. Good evening. Good evening. Uh -huh. What's up? Hi. Hi. We're doing a we're doing a challenge because I think uh, I think I could win this one. I'm never very confident about games in general, and it's like I'm not that good. I don't think I could win this, but I'll give it my best. I think I could win this one. I think this is gonna be you the think? one that best. I, this is the one that best for old. This is the one that Grandpa finally wins. You know. Is this the one Grandpa wins? Um. Okay. Well, <laughs> do you, do you want to introduce yourself first? Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Good evening, everybody. My name is Vesper Noir. I am the resident scholar of the Adventures Guild Tempest and a member of Hall of Stars English. And I have a guest here tonight. Hi, it's me. What's up? <laughs> uh, my name is... Be oh, wait, wait, full name. Sorry, I'm not used to saying my full name. My name is Bell Takeoff, representing Chaos from Hollow Eaton Council. What's up, everybody? I'm here. Hello, hello. Thank you for hanging out with me tonight, Heiko Senpai. <laughs> Hello, I'm here. I... Oh, volume check. Hello, one, two. Should be good. Are we good? It should be fine. I think we should be more or less even. Best for quite. I think they're. I'm being <gasps> trolled. No, no, because should... it's a meme. I don't know, Senpai. I don't know if you've seen it before, but people do. People do a thing where it's like best for muted. Oh. Uh. Is it true? A little bit quiet. Okay, I can turn it up. I can turn it up. <laughs> How's that? Better. Better? I, I, at this point, I can't tell whether they're trolling oh, me or no, not. Oh, no, that's better. You, you were a bit quiet on Discord as well. So. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Okay, there we go. All right, here we go. <laughs> so. Yeah, we're here! Yeah, 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 yeah. I think I can win this one. Do <laughs> you think you can win? Do you want to explain what, what, what this is yes. first? Yes. So, I'm, I'm a boomer. I know a lot of old <laughs> stuff, like eldritch knowledge from the ancient times. And, uh -huh, then, uh -huh. and then my... People have said that my complete opposite is Heiko Senpai, uh -huh. right? <laughs> no, no, uh, no. E uh, yeah? Uh, 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 I think I'm a... Okay, well, first of all, I don't go around you saying, hello, I'm a Zuma. But um, <laughs> I, I would think that I don't have a lot of knowledge in a lot of areas. So okay. maybe I'm just... Yeah, but I will fulfill the role of Zuma today. Um, in in among like overseas holo pro you would be the zoomer that is true i mean i think it's just because uh i'm actually 12 so people just yes take that and just run with it that i'm a zoomer um i've so. actually heard that before and it is because leap year right am i correct is that is that the the reason no i'm just 12 forever perpetually 12 i actually didn't know this lore because I, yeah. I know your birthday. Yeah. And then I assume the 12th thing is just like, because, you know, leap year every four years. So it's just like you're actually... Oh! No? What? I'm actually what? <laughs> you're actually... You're actually... 40, 40, 48? <laughs> no. I'm forever 12. What are you talking about? Oi, oi, oi. 40, 48? 48? No? Is the boomer calling me old? <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> no, I'm 12. Thank you very much. Okay. Um, yes. So... Can a 12-year-old stream? <laughs> <laughs> is it okay? Isn't the term... Wait, no, isn't the term of service technically 13? <laughs> yeah, that's what I was thinking too. I was like, can it... Can you... Um, I'm, I'm actually you guys 12 and a half. I'm, I'm actually 12 and a half. So it kind of rounds up. <laughs> it rounds up. It rounds up, you I know. Hope, uh, I hope Susan isn't watching. <laughs> <laughs> I just wake up next day and my entire yeah, channel no, is taken no, down. No. <laughs> It's happened before. <laughs> oh no! Anyway, it's okay. Yeah. Anyway, yeah, 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 Welcome okay. to Boomer versus Zoomer, everyone. A welcome, welcome. um, is it a quiz? Is what? What is this? So, so I think we have images and such. 
most of, mostly images, and then I will show mm-hmm. it. And then we will we'll have like a set amount of time, like a minute, two minutes or so to look it over and try mm-hmm. to understand what it is. And I think we will allow guessing, right? Like if you look at it through context yeah. and be like, what is it? Like, what is it? And if you're close enough, I, I feel like we're both pretty charitable people. Like we're both on the kinder end of the spectrum. Like, so we'll just be like, okay, you're close enough. I'll give, I'll give you that. And even if you're not like spot on, because if you don't know exactly what the item is and there's no way you'll, you'll be spot on. But if you're like kind of close and it'll be like, okay, I'll give you that. And we'll be, we'll be charitable. And, um, where did you get that thought from? What? <laughs> you think I'm gonna let you have an easy win? Hell oh, nah. no. Because I feel like I'm kind of... Uh... <laughs> you think I was gonna give you pity no charity? points? No, no charity? hell Charitable no. In... Wow, okay. I think I'm gonna get smacked <laughs> down. Well, I have to stick to... I have to... I have to stick to my character setting, so I think I will... I, if you're close enough, I'll be like, okay. 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 I'll give you that one. You don't have to. Obviously, okay. you're the senpai. You could be. You could be like no. <laughs> okay. Yes. I might. Ow. I might lose then. Okay. I'm a little bit less confident. <laughs> but anyways, what we're gonna do, guys, yeah. is we're gonna go back and Wait. forth. Wait. Huh? Yes. Sorry, no. Uh, I just have a question. But yes. Continue explaining first. Okay. My I'll brain just... doesn't work. <laughs> what? Nothing. <laughs> 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 okay. Okay. I'll, I'll explain it really quick. So we're gonna go back and forth. Um. Unfortunately, Heiko Senpai did not send me the, the files, the images beforehand, because it's, it would be cheating if I if I uploaded it onto my OBS. So, so Heiko Senpai will send me the thing that I need to do. I will download it, upload it into my OBS scene, and then show it. And then and then it'll be it'll be even because there's no way she hasn't seen my stuff. I shouldn't have seen her stuff. So I think that's the only way to do it fair. And it might take like 30 seconds to a minute for me mm-hmm. to set it up on my OBS. I hope you guys will be patient. Mm-hmm. And uh yeah, we're just gonna go back and forth. We have eight pieces of zoomer versus boomer culture and mm-hmm. the person that has less in the end loses and then i think we're gonna do like a batsu game right like uh loser loser yes yeah yeah we'll decide that before we start but uh hey goes about you were yeah. gonna say something? uh i was you know to warm up um i was just gonna ask can you please explain what your stream title is what's my stream i don't th- understand i don't understand hold on, hold on, hold on. i actually because i i kind of like i kind of no brain my stream titles because my manager. I'm gonna be honest. Me... I opened up YouTube today and I saw the waiting room. Yeah. And then I thought <laughs> you had, <laughs> I thought you had copy pasted or like reused your settings and you just forgot to change the title. <laughs> uh, I don't understand. Okay. N- no items. Fox only. Final destination. That's what you're asking about, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I I actually completely forgot. Okay. So, I'll just explain it to you. Um, you know about the Smash Brothers franchise, like the game, the video game franchise, Smash Brothers. Yes. Okay. Um, I think it was the most competitive one. There was a Smash Brothers version. I don't know where it was because I wasn't that into Smash too much. A little bit. Uh huh. I think it was Smash Brothers Melee. Was it on the GameCube? I don't remember. But it was a Smash Brothers game, right? And it was very, very. Com- there was a very, very fleshed out competitive scene for it, and and the people that were really sweaty in in the Smash Brothers Melee game. Uh-huh. They wanted it to be absolute. They wanted to remove all like luck because there's a lot of luck in Smash Brothers, right? Like you can get like items and stuff like that. You can get like yeah. supers. Yeah. So so the idea it's it's just like a ch- it's a challenge statement from a really sweaty Smash Brothers player. Like if they wanted to f- play against you in Smash Brothers to to prove that they're better than you at the game, they would be like no items, box only, final destination. Mm-hmm. And then you would play each other on the most boring like setting to prove like who had the better reflexes, who was just better at the game. Uh. And it and it became a meme just because like it, it, you're making fun of people that do that. <laughs> They're like right. too too sweaty in the video game. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Minus one bay! No, that was a practice round! That doesn't count! <laughs> there's no way you would there's no way you would know that. <laughs> and it doesn't count. It doesn't count. It's just It doesn't count. It doesn't count. <laughs> Okay, thank you. Confidence thank you is much. surging, everybody. I think I might be able to pull out a victory. Confidence <laughs> is surging. Okay. Let's just decide like a Batsu game and then we'll jump into it. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. Um, um, we were actually talking about this as we were setting up. Are you confident in your trolling game? No, I'm probably the weakest troll in Tempest. Like, I, I feel and unfortunately, bad. Unfortunately, I think me too. <laughs> well, uh, it. Does it run? Is it genetic? Uh, 
which is like really like bad. Like grandfather, at, at like grandchild. <laughs> See, this is why I was assuming that that we would show each other mercy, right? No, it doesn't. It doesn't extend as far as like no, mercy. No, that no. doesn't extend. No. Well, anyway. one random tweet. One random tweet. Oh, the tweet butts game. I like that. Yeah. Okay. Should we okay. Make, should we do the tweet? I don't know if I could. Butts game. If if I win, I don't know if I could. Okay, I have an idea. <laughs> mm. Because we're both bad at it, why don't we swap it around? <laughs> Ooh. Like the winner, <laughs> the winner has I don't to get. I win then! I'm so bad. No, no, uh, the winner has to get trolled, right? Oh, the winner has to get trolled. Yeah. Oh wait, what? <laughs> oh, I see, I see, I like see. Like usually the loser gets trolled, but now the winner right, gets. Right, right, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Like I would rather win and you force me to tweet something that trolls me, then I don't have to think of anything that's like potentially mean or whatever, right? <laughs> Yeah, everybody's like, Nani, that's not how it works. Don't do it. Small brain. Yeah, but like, I would honestly no, no, like... That's, that's genius. In a, hypothetical, mm -hmm. in a hypothetical situation where I win, I wouldn't want to write anything on your Twitter. So I would just right. rather you... I would rather force you to troll me. And it's like, haha, it's going to be really, you know, lame. Yeah, and you expose how bad the other person's trolling is. Got yeah, it. yeah, yeah, yeah. And then right. if you win, I have to think up a tweet to troll you. And then everybody knows how lame I am, right? Yes, that's big brain. Okay, okay. that okay. works. That's the Batsu game. Like a reverse, like, tweet Batsu game. Okay, okay. Okay, sound good. <sighs> okay, I'll start it off. <laughs> okay. It's an image. Are you ready? It's an image. Okay, ready, I'm ready. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Looks like everybody's ready. 141 IQ. Okay. Boom. Shut up! Oh my god! <laughs> Sorry, that was a reference. <gasps> I know this one! I knew it. <laughs> I, I started it! easy. What is it? Uh, it's a... It's a... You don't have to give me the name. Just tell me what, like, you, you can it's just tell me. Tama, tama, ta, ta, tama got cheese at the name. There you go. It's you got like, the name. Yeah. Yay! Okay. I always wanted one, but I never, I was never purchased one. It blew my mind that you could take care of a pet and, like, clean up its poop so easily via yeah. three buttons. Yeah. I was thinking this is, I started off, this is number one, because I was like, I should, I should go a little bit easy. And I thought that even if you didn't know what this was, because this is the precursor, after Tamagotchi, Digimon became like really big. And I was thinking like, <gasps> Heiko Senpai would probably know Digimon. And Digimon was basically a Tamagotchi that could fight. You could like connect the two little things. There was like a little connector and you could make them fight against each other. I don't know if you knew this. Really? It's, it's, a, it's like, it was, a, it was a direct descendant of the Tamagotchi. It's like a Tamagotchi with a little like connector on the end. What? Yeah. What? <laughs> so I was going to say like, I didn't. I honestly didn't expect you to know even the name. So it's like kudos that you knew Tamagotchi. On, but if you were like, it's like a Digimon. Gosh. It's like a Digimon. I would have given you Digimon. Because... Oh, I don't even know Digimon at all. So yeah, I wouldn't have said Digimon. I'm almost certain that you've played a Digimon game on stream. Oh yeah, that was the first time I've ever played Digimon or oh. like understood or was explained to Digimon. Yeah. So what you're saying is if I showed you like an like a Generation One Digimon thing. Which was I probably square. wouldn't know what it is. I would have won. Okay. Well, I mean, I this is this is this is my gimme. This is the one that was like, I feel bad for senpai. Like most of my stuff I is see, from I like see. 1989, and there's like I see, zero I see. percent chance. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I okay. see. I see. I see. Okay. Your turn. Your turn. Yeah, uh, that's okay. one for my you. My turn. My turn. Yeah. Okay. One for me. We need to keep points. Um, chat, help us keep points. Yeah, yeah. They'll keep points. They'll keep points. Keep the keep the score. Okay. My first one is also a pretty easy one. Okay. Um, okay. it's. There's no way you don't know this. Oh yeah, I, I know that. Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna. I'm gonna Starting go easy. I'm Starting easy. Download it. Download it. Okay. And then. I think this exposes how, what my thought was, because there was a genuine like three seconds that, I think I was like, <laughs> I don't think I don't know if he actually knows this. I know this, yeah. Okay. Good. Okay, you started okay, easy. Okay. 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 So I think okay. I We're think. We're starting easy. Okay. Okay. You you keep saying like, okay. Does everybody see it? Everybody. Move that back, like so. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, flossing. It's mm -hmm. a dance, right? Mm -hmm. 
It's a dance, and do you want me to describe it, or is that enough that I know that it's a dance that that the zoomers are doing? Now you gotta describe it. Okay, so it's like it's like you've got your hands straight out, and you're moving Uh them back and forth behind your hips, and Uh you're and you're moving like left and right, and it's like Uh you're basically like a tooth that's being flossed, right? (laughs) Like your body is a tooth, and your hands are like flossing, like right. (laughs) Like, that's uh-huh, what it looks okay. like. I don't know if that's actually why it's called flossing. I just know that's what it looks like. And it's like, mm-hmm. your hands are, like, going back and forth, like, over your body. Like, mm-hmm. yeah. Okay. Not bad. Actually. I don't know. I don't know why I thought you wouldn't know this, but there was a genuine doubt. Um, that you, <laughs> wouldn't, wouldn't know. you wouldn't know the name. Like, you might know the dance if you saw it. Like, you recognize it, but yeah. you don't know the name of the yeah, actual. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Actually, I like the floss because... Do you watch anime? Uh, you watch anime. Have you watched Yo Pe- Yo Mushi Pedal? No, I haven't. Oh, you haven't watched I it? To. There's like the main villain. <laughs> the main villain does like the, that the flossing motion. Like he does it in one scene, and it became he a does? meme. It, it became a meme for that anime, and that's how I figured oh. out about flossing. And his name is Midosuji, and he does like a weird like thing where he's moving his arm. His arms are like rigid, and they're moving like back and forth. And then people people made like gif images of it, and it's like, oh, he's flossing. Midosuji is flossing. So, that, so I looked it up, and it's like, okay, that's a floss. It's a it's a thing that Zoomers are doing on TikTok. <laughs> okay, I didn't hear that. Oh, I, I okay, I felt that. You know, Zoom is doing it on TikTok. Sorry, that was a very boomer line. I felt that to the core. It shook me. I know um, a fair amount of like <laughs> Zoomer dances. <laughs> I see. I okay. see. I hope you didn't load up. It's not loaded with the hmm. zoom. Mm-hmm. Well, this, this, uh... I'll take the win if it if I get one. But Uh-oh. yeah, okay. So one okay. one so far, right? Okay, okay. Doing pretty good. Doing pretty good. Okay, are you ready for number two? Yes. Okay, number two starting now. Do you know what that is? <gasps> Wait a second. I need context clues. Um, <laughs> my board. I made sure to add a lot of context clues so you know, like, what it, yeah. Wow, you're so nice. Mm-hmm, um, mm-hmm. There's a white boy. Is this a classroom? Uh, okay. Should I answer that? I think, I think I'll keep my mouth shut. I feel- white. Is this, like... It's, is it like a uh, like a div- okay? Is it like a device you put something to 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 magnify something on, and then it um it, wait, it's, okay, its so, purpose is not to magnify. Not you're, to you're, magnify. You're kind of on the okay. right track. It is a very I specific just, yeah. purpose, and if you can get it, then I'll be like, okay, you're close enough. But you're you're on the right track, but not quite. Like, okay. if you end it there, like I would say, that's not correct. Um, there was something on the top. Okay, okay. There's there's a light shining down, and there's something that flips up. Yes. Um, <laughs> I'm not looking not at chat, but I'm part. imagining them going like insane. <laughs> <laughs> Projector? Yes. Okay, you got it. Okay. Is it? Yeah. It is. It's a projector. All right. Two out. Two out of two out of eight. Hey, very nice. Oh my god. So, so have you seen one? Like, do you do you know? Have, have you ever seen one in action? I don't think so. You just you just know from like context. Yeah, it's definitely a yeah, classroom, because... and you can you can see the little like slides, right? Do you see the? Do you Wait, see the slides? Oh, yeah. that's a slide. I didn't see that. No, I just I was trying to figure out what that thing on the top is. Yeah. Um. Because it was if it's just like a magnifying tool, then you wouldn't have that at the top. And also, yeah. there's a like really bright light. The thing at the top is a mirror, and it and it oh. it shines light from the bottom through a clear piece of like plastic that you can write on, and then it hits the mirror, and then it gets projected out onto a big screen. It's like a screen projector, and so like what? in the olden days when you were taking a class, and I and I double checked to make sure this was a thing in like your area. Like classrooms right. used to have this, so it's not just. Oh, yeah. okay. Damn. So, so like a math teacher would be like solving math problems, and to get the whole classroom to see like what they were doing, like one plus one equals like question mark, and then. Well, why wouldn't you just use the whiteboard then? 
you could use the whiteboard, but this was generally like quicker. And also oh. uh, just, just for a lot of reasons, right? Like a teacher, a teacher could just sit at this projector and write while they were doing it. Oh, or if you I wanted see. to give a presentation, you could also give a presentation with the slides. Like you could just boom, like slide, 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 slide. You wouldn't need to bother writing it. Like it could be pre-written. <gasps> it's like oh. a, it's like a, it's like a, it's like an analog PowerPoint presentation. <laughs> If you had the slides like pre-prepared, it's like analog PowerPoint and you had like each slide, you know? Yeah. Yeah. There was uh -huh. a lot of reasons to use stuff like this. It, it was in oh. almost every single classroom and then it, it basically went away. Uh, Probably I around like... For like classrooms, uh, I, I, I'm more used to smart boards. Yeah. 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 <laughs> hey, I still got it! Oh, good! <laughs> this is a curveball. I threw like a little bit more difficult one because this one was phased out like early mid 2000s. They were still in classrooms around then, but they weren't being used as much. They were used a lot in the 1990s. Oh, a lot. I see. And 80s. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. so two out of two out of eight. Uh oh. Two out of eight. Uh oh. Okay. Okay, your turn. <laughs> okay, this is the next one. Hi. Um, a preface. Uh -huh. Um, I had two very kind Holo Pro members help draw some of these. Um, <laughs> why are you what? silent? <laughs> why does it know what this is? Uh -oh. Nice. Okay, okay, okay. I, I gotta think. I'm so, so I had to ask someone uh, to help draw some of these because it, it's, or I don't know how to explain it. So, what I've done is uh, this one that. A uh, Vesper is showing on stream was kindly drawn by Zeta. Thank you very much, Zeta. I love you. Um, but I'm also sending a screenshot of like the real thing to Vesper as well. I. <laughs> uh. Yeah, show me the image. Uh. Oh wait, wait, wait. Hold on. It, it's it, it's gonna have its. Oh, uh, it has a name, right? So it's fine. Yeah, 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 okay, yeah. Okay. No, it, it tells me what it is. <laughs> I'm oh, okay. I'm gonna be honest with you, like there's no way I would have gotten this. I would have guessed, okay, so... <laughs> I'll just give you my guess and we'll go with it. Okay, <laughs> okay. Right. This. If you look at it, it's got like... <laughs> oh! <laughs> stupid, oh my god! <laughs> okay, this is what I would have guessed. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Cause you could clearly see the little like bubbles on the inside. I would have guessed yes. this is like big enough to sit on. And you like it's like a slip and slide thing. Like there's like a like. Oh. Like, right. What is this like? Uh huh. Uh huh. Like I would have guessed like a pad to sit on, like a like a seat a, pad. Ah, uh, a seat pad. Right, yeah, right. but it's like pop it toy. I don't know. Yeah. How big is it? Like I I lost. I'll take the loss. Like there's, I have no idea what this is. Like. <laughs> yes. Okay. Uh, I was stupid and I sent a screenshot of someone actually using it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, anyway, so it's a modern interpretation of something like a fidget spinner. It's for people who I know what a fidget like spinner fidgety. is. Yeah. yeah. Um, good because I I would nearly put fidget spinner, but I thought that might be too, too easy. easy, so I changed it to a more modern version. Yeah. Um, it's pretty much a piece of silicon, and then it has just a bubble, and then you just press it, and it goes to the other side. And when you popped all the bubbles, you flip it around, and you just keep. <laughs> how big is it? Oh, so if you look at the photo, that's pretty much how big it is. It comes in different sizes. Oh, there's normally okay, it's I can look at the it, normally it's like two hands. It's not it's not that big. It can be really big. Depends, oh. you know, how big you get it. Is it rigid? It looks like it's hard plastic, and on the inside it's like a bubble. It's, it's silicon. Like the entire thing is just silicon. So it's flexible. Like everything's yeah. Okay. Yeah. To me, oh. this looked like yeah. this looked like a like a cushion because of the edge. <laughs> It doesn't look like a raised edge. It looks like the edge of a cushion. Like the oh, image. yeah. Huh. But, yeah. This is something that you see uh, for a lot of people who have stress. Apparently, they say it's a stress relief. Um, it's very satisfying to pop the bubbles. And then you just flip it over and do it again. Oh, no. I'm behind. I'm behind. <laughs> I, I'll, I'll take the loss on this one. I actually have no idea. Like, I've never seen it. I think the last... This style of thing that I've seen is like the actual fidget spinner where it's like it's like three prongs and then like it just yeah. spins in your hand. That's the last yeah. thing I've seen of stuff like this. And that, yeah. Do, do you own a fidget spinner? I never did, but 
<laughs> I never did, but uh, I had a family member that like needed it. And so like, oh. I, I very much know what it is and, and they collected a whole bunch of them. So like anytime I visited them, I would bring them like an interesting colored one. And it was easy because e they're not that expensive. And it's just like a good way to keep a family member happy. And, uh, not that expensive. Oh, okay. Fidget spinners aren't that expensive, right? <laughs> Depends which one you get. Yeah, I mean, you could get like super expensive ones, but I never got, I never got like a $20 right, right, fidget spinner. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. But this, I'll take the loss. Of, like, no way. I just, no way I would have guessed it. Okay. Uh, Things not <laughs> looking good for grabs. <laughs> okay, okay, we're moving on to number three. Okay, moving on. I gotta uh, be careful not to be stupid in <laughs> screenshot. Okay. Yeah, are you gonna are you gonna go back and like? <laughs> I'm gonna. I need to refigure out what do, I want. Do do a bit of cropping on this, like, cause it's like <laughs> like the, yeah. the image that you sent me says, fidget toy HF push pop bubble <laughs> fidget sensory toy bubble popper anxiety relief autism toy silicon fidget toy for ADD and it's like okay I know what it is. I know exactly what it is now. <laughs> it's like, hmm, hmm, what could that be? Oh, <laughs> you give the answer to someone when you're trying to quiz them. Listen, My God. I'll, I'll take the L on that because there's no way that I would have guessed it. I would I would have guessed cushion just because of the way mm, that it looks. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. Are you ready for Maybe number three? Loses a point for being stupid. Shut up. No. 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 Senpai does not lose a point. I'll I'll, I'll own up that like re logically, there's no way I would have guessed that. Like even okay, through context. Okay. okay. Number three. Okay. Are you okay, ready? Okay. Yes. I'm ready. <laughs> it's time for the counterattack, fellas. <laughs> fellas, it's time for the counterattack. <laughs> Are you sure this was this is Does this still exist? It does. It does? It does. Are you sure it's not some medieval torture device? It's not it's not medieval and it does exist oh. and it existed in uh where you live. <laughs> oh. It's, it's out of use. It's not really, like, practical anymore for a lot of reasons. But uh -huh. up until, like, the early 2000s, like, you would find it. Yeah. Uh... And I'm not going to tell you where you would find it, but you would find okay. it. Okay. There's a handle, so you spin it. I'm going to guess, is it an olden version of a meat grinder? No, it's not. Damn it. So you're not even what close. There, there's no way to fix... Well, you know, you could, you could think about it. You could think well, about I mean, it. I already guess. That's already my guessed. guess. That's the, that's the immediate thing I thought of. I saw yeah. the handle. Yeah. And I think I see like a little circle thing at the front. So I was like, is, is it a meat grinder? It is not a meat grinder. Okay. So, it's not a meat grinder, so oh. we, we both missed one. Yes! If I If I get the next one, then we're even. But we're not even yet. Right? Okay. Okay. I will tell you what it is. This what is, is it? a pencil sharpener. <laughs> What? It's a pencil sharpener that you would find in <gasps> every single classroom. Every oh, classroom. Primary wait. school. Oh, even even I middle school. Yeah, like every single I school used it. to have one of these in every classroom. It would usually be mounted to a cabinet or even the wall. And uh, you could just stick a pencil in on the other end with the cap. Uh -huh. And then turn the turn the grinder, the handle bit, and it would, it would sharpen a pencil. And <gasps> might I add... This thing was incredibly bad at sharpening pencils. It was like notorious oh. for being really bad. Oh, no, it, I see it now because I, I know there were some pencil sharpeners that were really cute and they were like, um, they had like the turny thing at the back. It didn't look like this. Yeah. This looks industrial. This is, this is a really cute yeah. one. This is the yeah. thing that would be mounted in a classroom. Like, oh. like, a, like a public school would buy 500 of these and, and put them in every single classroom. And have a couple Wait, of like what? Yeah. The ones that we have were automatic though. You just stick it in and go. Yeah, Bleh. yeah. It's like it's like an electric pencil sharpener, right? Yeah. 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 Oh. <laughs> it looks like a meat grinder. Yeah. I mean. Yeah, it, yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm catching yes! up. <laughs> oh. Okay. Next one. Next one. I'm ready. I'm ready. Okay. <laughs> what? Okay. Um. This one, you have to guess what it entails. So I, I, I tell you what it is. You have to tell me what, what? it entails. Okay, okay. But so you have to explain the concept of this to me. Okay. But you're gonna tell me the name? Okay. Yeah. Well, yeah okay. Okay. Yeah. It's not a thing. It's like it's not like a physical object. So. Wait. So there's no picture? Like you just can tell there me. Is, the there is. There is kind of, kind of. Anyway. Okay. Um, okay. 
So you have to explain to me the purpose <laughs> of this. Oh no. That doesn't sound good. Do you know what this is? I think I know the concept of, of Snapchat. Yeah. Oh, look. Uh oh. Maybe I'm I'm being too easy with these. Uh -oh. Here's the thing, like I never used it, but I knew I know the I know like what it's what it is. <laughs> like I know what Snapchat is, but even though if I even if I've never used it, right? So and I and I've heard streaks, like I know that. Okay. And I have to be like a hundred percent correct. There's no way you're not gonna Yeah. Oh my god, okay. Okay, so I know what Snapchat is. Like, I know what the, the app does. And basically uh -huh. what Snapchat is, is it's a video sharing app. And uh -huh. after a set amount of time, the video disappears, right? Yes. That's like, that's what makes Snapchat different from, say, like, Instagram or Twitter, like, video and stuff like that. Like, those stay until you delete it. But Snapchat, the thing that makes it different is that, like, you post a video and then after a set amount of time, I actually don't know the exact amount of time. Please don't make me know the exact amount of time. It disappears. <laughs> it gets deleted, right? Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's yeah, say, yeah, like, yeah. 20, whatever. Like, it's just a yeah. set amount of time that disappears. So, okay. the concept of Snapchat is that you need to upload videos that are interesting and then people will follow you. Okay. And then they, they, they watch your video, right? Okay. Uh-huh. Is, uh, is a Snapchat daily streak... <laughs> Like whether your follower like doesn't miss the videos that you upload, like they, they're watching them and they're not missing any of your videos. And then if they miss one, they lose their streak. Oh, I feel bad. Should I give it to him? I feel bad. It's a good guess. It's, it's a good really guess, but it's incorrect. I'll, I'll take the loss. Like, tell, tell me what it is. I mean, okay. Do you want to try that picture that I sent? Do you, uh, with oh, the I didn't, I didn't even see the picture. No, no, no. It's the thing. I didn't send anything. The one that I drew there. Do you see that? Uh, the black box with, underneath? The, with the red yeah, yeah, line. Yeah, yeah, With the red yeah. line. What do you think that is? What is that? <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> I like actually have no idea. <laughs> okay. I'll take the L. I'll take the L. I lost this one, so I'm I'm, I'm done okay. here. Oh my a god. Snapchat daily streak is um you, it was a really good guess. Um so pretty much on Snapchat you can you send like you can send snaps to friends, you know. Okay. Um and it's not just like a Instagram story type thing. Okay. It's you can technically just send um direct messages through the Snapchats. And if you Snapchat a person every single day and they Snapchat you back every single day, you start what is called a streak. Oh. And then next to their name, the counter would start with like a fire emoji. And that tells you how many days you've streaked for with this person. But they always have to respond to you every single day. Yeah. And you have to respond to them every single day. So there was this thing that it got really big where you would want to keep a streak going for as long as you can. Interesting. Um, right. And this, <laughs> this photo thing that I drew here yeah, refers yeah. to when you have so many streaks and your only purpose of sending a, a Snapchat is to continue the streak. Normally you would mass send a black screen with a red S to signify that. How would I, <laughs> how would I know that? <laughs> How does that count as a clue? Like, how would I... Look at it! It's just a black box with the red S! Like, how would I... That's not a clue! I mean, I, I took this L because I, I, I've never actually used the app, and there's no way, you know? This is a legitimate loss, right? And especially because I know what Snapchat is. Like, I know what the... But, like, this is not a clue, Senpai. Come on. Okay, fine. I, you know what? That was a really good guess. I feel bad. You no, 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 point for no, that. no, no. That's not. A, I, I, I play by the rules because I think uh, the easy stuff ends. Like, <laughs> I'm hopefully if I could just if you lose every single one from here on out and I catch one, <laughs> then I can catch up and we're dead even, right? Okay, that's. I'm true. only that's behind true. by one, even though I'm I'm one for three right now. You're two for three, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, yeah. are you two for three? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you're, yeah, 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 yeah. You're two for three. Okay. Two for three. Okay. Um, oh, man. If it wasn't a black box with a red S, I think the other most commonly sent mass uh, Snapchat streak photo was like a picture of like your shoulder. <laughs> um, like you would just quickly snap a picture of your shoulder and just write like a red S over to, it. To my mind, that's kind of like cheating. Like, no? 
I don't know. If your Cheating goal is in what way? Oh. Like like if you're trying to keep a streak going, but like you're just tired and you don't want to actually send because the point of Snapchat oh, is to send entertaining videos. It's like you're not entertaining someone with just a blank screen with like an S. Yeah, a hundred percent. But it's also to like just individual people. It's not like to to the public. Yeah, it yeah. Sounds yeah. dumb. Of course it's dumb. Most Zoomer things are dumb. That's the point of being Zoomer is to be dumb. I did this every day, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> Did you did you do the did you do the the oh, blank screen? Oh come 100%. on, come on, that's against okay, the screen. Okay, the, okay. The blank screen was on the days that I really couldn't be bothered. Most of the time, it was the hair shot. It was the hair over the shoulder shot where you couldn't see my face with the red S. That's what I used to do. I mean, what I would do if I just had literally nothing and I had a pet, it would just be like a pet video, right? Because everybody loves pet videos and, and like, you know, the pet will never act the same way twice. Just, here you go, video of my pet, like a cat or whatever. That's what oh, I would have done. I see. Yeah. <laughs> but anyways, I'll take the L. <sighs> all right, all right. Number four, number four. Okay, number four, okay. Do you know what that is? Cool. Okay, that's the record button. I have no clue. I have no clue what this is. Uh, <laughs> um, is that like a mini mini recorder? It is not. It's not a mini. Damn it! It's got a record button. What is it? Oh wait, is that a volume? I don't know what that is. <laughs> We're back in, boys. <laughs> so you have to give up like you just have no idea what it is right i, I have no clue what okay. it is i see the only thing i can understand from that is the record button and it's not a mini recorder that you it's, secretly it's not record a recorder. people from it's okay. not it's not okay i will tell you what it is i'm gonna uh -huh. give you the name it's known commonly by two names right okay and if i'm gonna see if you know it okay, okay. so the first name the original like the official name that it's called is uh -huh. called a pager do you know what a pager is no. Do you know what a beeper is? It's also called a no. beeper, but that's more of like a colloquial term. Okay. It's a pager. So this... <laughs> How do I explain this to people? Do you understand pager. that there was a point in time in human <laughs> society before cell phones existed? <laughs> do you understand that there was a point in time in human society before cell phones existed? Like, can that enter your consciousness? Can you imagine a time where cell phones did not exist? <laughs> Okay. <laughs> That's really patronizing. This is a I senpai. Know. I can't talk this way to a senpai. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. This is this this a uh, pager existed. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, uh, that is okay. It was really funny. <laughs> a pager existed. Just, can I be honest? It yeah. never crossed my mind. <laughs> I mean, like uh, this is so patronizing because, of course, like before electricity existed, like in medieval ages, like oh no, yeah. they still had cell phones, right? Like, of course, like cell phones didn't exist in the past, right? A pager existed like <laughs> right before cell phones were invented. Oh. Like like five years before the cell phone was invented, the pager uh -huh. was invented. And what a pager does is it works. It has like reception and it works wirelessly, kind of like the way that a cell phone does, right? But the only okay. thing that it could do is you would you would go to a phone, like a landline phone that was connected, right, to the wall, or you could go to like a payphone. Do you know what a payphone is? It's not in the thing. You, you, Payphone, yes. Okay. The other way is you could go to a payphone or you could go like from home. You just need access to a, a working telephone. You could type down the number of the pager and the pager had a normal like phone number, right? So you would you punch in the number of the pager and it would call the pager. And then once it was connected, you could punch in more numbers, right? And usually you would punch in the number of the phone that you were calling from, <laughs> right? And then the pager in the person that you were trying to call would get the phone number, right? They would get the phone number on that dial-up and they'd be like, okay, someone is paging me. They want to talk to me. They would go to the nearest phone and they would call that number and call back the person that tried to call them and then they would do their phone conversation. So it's kind of like an alert, like a mobile answering machine to let you know that somebody wanted to talk to you pretty urgently. And uh, there was a definitely less than legal group of people that use this for nefarious purposes, but also doctors used it. It was pretty common for doctors in hospitals to use pagers. There, okay. Yeah, there was like, 
I can't, I don't know if it's coming across, but I'm so confused right now. Wait, wait, wait. Did you not understand the purpose of a pager? Like, you just, that. I, I didn't, I, okay, so it alerts you if someone was calling you? You could call a, it, all right, so a pager is basically, <laughs> like, all right, a pager is like a machine that, that receives text messages. You can't send them, but you can receive text messages, right? But okay. instead of text messages, it's just numbers. Like you can't send letters, it's just numbers. So it's like a text message receiving device that only receives numbers. And okay. and okay. how it works is that like you receive a number and it's usually a phone number. Okay. And your brain is like, somebody wants me to call them because they would need to talk to me urgently. And then you would okay. take that number, you would go to a landline phone and you would dial the number that they gave you. And then they would pick up on the other end. They would be like, okay, here's what I wanted to talk to you about. Why wouldn't they just call them directly? Wait, hold on. I need to think before I speak in, in case that's a stupid question. Wait a second. Hold on. Why wouldn't they call them directly? <laughs> we got her, boys. We got her. She completely has no idea what the concept of a phaser is. We got her. Got him. Like, because you can call a landline, can't you? You could call, but how would you know that someone wanted to talk to you? How would you know that? Because he would call them. What? No, if somebody... All right. So, for example, um, let's say... Let's say you're a doctor. Could you, like, imagine that you're a doctor? And you're doing no. your... Yeah, yeah. And you're doing your rounds in the hospital, right? Uh, yeah. And let's say another doctor is like, I urgently need to get in contact with Dr. Bales because a patient of theirs, of hers, is, is like... Like going going south like we need we need her oh. at this patient right now but but like how do we tell her that because cell phones don't exist so they would like page you immediately and then you would get the number and you'd be like oh okay somebody needs me you would go to like oh. one of the hospital phones and pick up and they'd be like dr bales like we need you to get over to like room room 101 like immediately because like the, your patient is is you know <laughs> yeah oh i get it i get it and then yeah. another group of people my, yeah, another group okay. of people would use it but they're not like they're the opposite of doctor they're, like they're yeah. <laughs> bad people oh, would oh, also uh -huh. use it for other things, but I'm not oh, going to tell you what that bad is. Bad people? But... Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So you'll in take... my mind, it was like, if you're just chilling at home with the landline, why would you need someone to tell you they want to call you in... instead of just calling the landline? Here's the thing. When I was younger, <laughs> before cell phones, <laughs> right before cell phones uh -huh. existed, uh -huh. it was very uh -huh. trendy for kids to have these because, because... The group of bad people <laughs> would be like, uh -huh. it's cool that they have it. I want it too. So so kids would would have pagers, but they would have nothing to use it for. And people would send stupid like you know the message where like you could you could say you could write hello with numbers, right? Yeah. We used to do that. Like we used to page each other and it was incredibly expensive because each time you page someone it cost like 80 cents. <laughs> and then you could but turn the pager it upside down. Money? It costs a lot of money to send to send like to beep someone, to, to page someone. It costs a little, like an insane amount of money. Oh. You could get like a flat rate plan or you could like, it would be like per page and it would be very, very insanely expensive. <laughs> so oh my, so oh my God. kids really loved it and it was like considered really cool and it was uh -huh. it was dumb because <laughs> yeah, like you said, what use would a, would a child have it for a pager? But this was five oh. years in the span of like five years before cell phones were invented because obviously like after the invention of a cell phone like who would use a pager right uh-huh oh but mostly wait, doctors this only sends and... numbers right yeah only numbers <laughs> wait did you let me guess did you used to send uh uh messages like uh the thing that you did on the calculator uh like hello and stuff like that but i did not have a pager like it's too only, only like rich kids could have these because oh. the, the pager itself, I think I remember it costing like 120 to $150 for the, the machine, right? And then it required like essentially a cell phone plan because it's, it's like a wire, like it's on the wireless oh. network. So it would require a plan and the plan would get really expensive. And I just family would be like, what, you're an idiot. Like what, what is a, what is an idiot child going to use a pager for? We're not going to give you one. But I remember desperately wanting one because all the cool kids at school had it, but I never had one. <laughs> That's like me and the iPod Touch. I really wanted one because the cool kids had one. But an iPod Touch is useful, right? You yeah. can listen to music. It's like a calculator. You can watch videos. You can do like a lot of stuff with it. A pager. I mean, Senpai, you, you've 
you've listened to my explanation of what a pager is. Like, what use does it have? <laughs> like, what I can don't it? No. It can't play music. It can't do anything. And it's the kids really wanted it, and it's like nuts. Um, Anyways, I'll take the win. <laughs> I was. I've never been more confused in my life. But okay, that was. <laughs> Wait, great. do you still Number not four. understand? I can. No, no, I understand now. I understand. The doctor. Now. The doctor example is the best way because doctors actually. Yeah, I think, yeah, yeah. I, I get think, the doctor. Example. I think up until like 2010, doctors where I live were still using pagers. Like they still used it. Ah, oh, I see. Yeah. I see. Yeah. Okay. Well, we're still two one at the moment. <laughs> uh oh. Yeah, I missed two. You um, missed one. No, no, no. Yeah. Wait. After this will be even if I get it. Yes. 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 Okay. Um. Okay. This one, it is a, a physical thing. You need to explain to me. You just gotta explain it, okay? Okay, okay. I just need to explain it. <laughs> you just need to explain it. Okay, okay. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna send you the real thing afterwards after you try and explain it. Okay, because okay, it's got that like makes a better spoiler. Sense. It's got like a spoiler? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what? Oh, no. Am I going to lose? Um, so, Zeta helped draw uh, a couple of these, and also Magni helped draw some of these as well. So, thank you very much. I wonder if this <laughs> is like a regional thing. I hope it's not. It's not. It's, it's not? not? So, it's, it's a thing not. that like, around <laughs> the world. Uh-huh. Okay. <sighs> okay. Ahem. <laughs> <clears throat> <laughs> okay, so it's clearly like a plastic bottle. <laughs> okay. It's clearly a plastic bottle. Okay. And it's not crumpled. It's like it's like whole. It's in whole condition, mm. and and <laughs> there's like stuff coming out of it, and it looks like it's in the shape. Okay, all right. Why would kids do this? Okay. Um. So, so I'm guessing, I'm guessing that uh -huh. what you did was you put a a viscous material that was colored in a, in an attractive color into the bottle, and it can't be water; it has to be viscous, right? Like it has to be like gooey, right? And then when you put it into the freezer, as it freezes, it turns into a solid. It expands, and it's gonna push stuff out. And because it's viscous, while it's still in the process of freezing, it won't. It'll it'll retain more or less its shape, and then that's what it looks like. That's the extra that's the extra volume that it gains from being frozen. What does viscous mean? Uh, viscosity is is viscosity is <laughs> it's the scientific scientific measurement of how thick it is, like the thickness oh, of okay, a liquid. Okay, okay, got it, got it, got it. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So if it's like if if like like honey, right? It's called frozen honey. Yeah. Honey is yeah. viscous, it has higher viscosity than water because when you pour it, it doesn't like just- Oh, yeah, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, and the thing is like, I think if you tried to do this with water, it wouldn't make that shape because it's in the process right, right, of freezing. Right. Yeah, so it right, requires right, right. something that's like fairly viscous to do that. Okay. I'm okay, hoping okay. kids didn't eat this. It was just something stupid they did because it looked cool. Um, okay, I'm gonna give you a chance to maybe change your answer. Okay. This is not a kids did this uh, thing. This was actually, this was a trend that started, uh, I think what? a year or two ago. And it what? wasn't kids. It was a very specific group of people. Would you like to change your answer? A very specific group of people. Yeah. So in order to pass this, I have to tell you what group of people did this. Yeah. And what they did it for. Yeah. If you can guess that, I'll give you the point. I'm getting bodied like this. It's just like a shot in the <laughs> dark. One or two years ago. What? <laughs> okay. <laughs> what? A very specific group of people did this. <laughs> What in tarnation? Okay, hold on a second. Oh my god! Wait, as you think, can I tell them what what what? 
you had a stream title called What in Tarnation, right? Yeah, yeah. And then I remember I saw that, and up until that point, I'd been saying What in Carnation. Because <laughs> uh, I didn't know what the phrase was. So thank you very much for teaching me. What in Carnation? Okay, okay. What is it? Is it What Incarnation? Because incarnation in itself is a word, or is it What I don't know. in Carnation, because a carnation is a type of flower, right? <laughs> Wait, which, it is? which, yeah, a carnation is oh. a flower. Well, so, have I been saying what in flower this entire time? I don't know. I have to. I have to guess, right? Like, um, is it? Is it? Is it ravers? I don't know. Like, I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea. Okay. Right. Um. So, frozen honey is literally just. Frozen honey. God uh, damn this... it, I got baited. <laughs> okay, alright. This what was group? a trend that started everywhere in the ASMR mukbang community. Okay. <laughs> Which they basically found that if you... Because you know how when you squeeze honey, it's, as you said, it's very thick, very yeah. viscous. Yeah. The word, right? Yeah. But they found if you actually froze honey, uh -huh. you and if you squeeze the bottle, it comes out and the texture is kind of like jelly. Yeah. So what they would do is they freeze it with like different food coloring and then they would just eat it. It's like hard honey. And it's like a texture that has never been seen before. If it's in the ASMR community, then it makes like a unique noise that people found yes. like nice. Yeah. But it's also very aesthetically pleasing because when you squeeze the bottle, it just comes out as a tube as if it's jelly. Is this even Zoomer knowledge? I feel like... It is. It, it, mean, was, it was like one or two years ago. Yeah, no, I'll, yeah. I'll take the L on this one. Like, I remember uh, I seeing it start like getting really popular one to two years ago. What? Um, yep. That's um, incomprehensible. <laughs> so they, they would. <sighs> uh, I might lose this one. Oh no! I shouldn't have gone easy. I should have gone with like the 1980s stuff and then just completely <laughs> destroyed you. Oh no! My hubris. <laughs> okay. That was your first mistake. Going I take, easy I take, on a senpai. I take the L. I take the L. <laughs> so I'm still behind by one. I'm still behind by one. Yes. Okay. Yes, there you are. Are you ready for number five? I'm, I'm ready. Okay. Okay. Here we go. <gasps> Haley! Shit. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I 100% know what this is because okay. I, I've wanted one. Um, okay, okay. I, 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 I fangirled over them. I loved Healy's, but I was never allowed to get any because every yeah. time I saw them, like someone wearing them at like the shopping center or whatever, I'll turn to Mama Rat and I'll be like, Mama, I want one. She's like, No, it's dangerous. It is dangerous. Yeah, there's an incredibly high rate of like people getting in accidents. I actually wanted <laughs> to use a related but different version of this, but I couldn't find a photo that I could show. So I went ah! with this one because it was a uh, it's a common 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 use license like on, on yeah, Wikipedia. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. So I'll take this out. You know this one. <sighs> I might lose this Three one. Three one. Do you know what a soap Three is? One. Do you know what soaps are? Like I originally wanted to do what? soaps. What's a soap? It's like related soap? to this. They're shoes. Like I'll give you that hint. I I lost no. anyways because I had to go with Heelys. All right. So soaps. Oh. Soaps were shoes. I actually own soaps. Like, I didn't own Heelys, but I own soaps. So, you know the what arch, the middle part of the sole of the shoe? Like, the arch part? Not the, the mm. area with the toe, not the heel, but like the middle part of yeah. the sole of the shoe. It was yeah, made yeah, out yeah. of hardened, smooth plastic that was like, indented. Why? And what kids used to do is that they used to go to like, curbs or like... Do you know like skateboarding when you grind on a surface? Do you know what skateboarding no. is? Okay, never mind. All right, so so you <laughs> know what a, you know what a curb is, right? Like, like curb of a street. Yeah, a curb of a street. So kids okay. would take would wear soaps, which were shoes that uh -huh. had a really smooth like arch area, and then they uh -huh. would take a bar of soap, and then they would like a soap up. They would soap up the edge of the curb, right? And then they would run at the curb once it was soaped up, and then jump and and hit the curb, and then like basically. You know, you know, like Sonic grinding on rails on his shoes. They would do that, like they would slide along the curb, like on the smooth part of of their shoes. I don't know if is it confusing so the you. The curb of a street. Wait, what? The uh, the curb of a street is typically made out of concrete, so you can't really slide yeah. along it, right? But if you yeah. if you if you if you rub a bar of soap 
on the edge, it makes it smooth and easier to slide. Oh, and that's why they're okay. called slopes. And then you could basically take, like, just run as fast as you could and then jump and hit <gasps> the curb. Oh, is like, it like... Oh, wait, so you know how... I've seen, like, skateboarding where people, like, jump on, like, handrails and stuff. Is it like that, but on the curb of the street with these shoes? Yes, yeah. Oh! So originally... Yes, I what? Yeah, I wanted to show you a pair of soaps oh. shoes, but I couldn't find... I couldn't find... <gasps> Something that oh, I could use on stream, so I was like, I'll do Healy's. Oh, I would have no idea what that was. You showed uh, it. I had a pair of those and I really liked them. Uh, Healy's oh. were like the lamer version of soaps, and they were also incredibly dangerous. Like, <laughs> oh, yeah, but they look so fun. Healy's, I remember. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I still want. Do you know they sell adult Healy's? And I was contemplating on buying it. <laughs> Why? I'm, I'm not I'm, Why? <laughs> because it's fun! It looks fun! I'm pretty sure I did this on stream as well. I opened... I was... <laughs> I nearly bought a pair of Heelys on stream. But I didn't realize that they made adult Heelys. Um, and... Yeah. <laughs> Why not? You, like, it's so fun! Rolling around on Heelys. <laughs> <laughs> So oh, lame. Really? It's so lame. <laughs> <laughs> That's so cool. <laughs> I'm actually crying. <laughs> <laughs> okay, please. <laughs> please live your best life. And these Heelys actually kind of fit your color scheme. <laughs> you should get these. I'm not, I'm not going to lie. I thought they were, they were, they were oh. really cool. Oh I, my god. Wait. Do they not? So yeah, adult Heelys! Oh I, yeah, adult size! That's my mistake oh. then. I assume that they didn't sell these anymore because they're oh. actually quite dangerous. And this company got sued like multiple times when I was a kid. And they went Wait, out of really? business. I think they went out of business because they got sued multiple times. Like kids were like... Kids were like breaking their like heads open. <laughs> They're like oh. breaking bones because of these things. And then like they disappeared yeah. off the market and nobody saw them ever again. Soaps oh. continued to become, like, they, they became irrelevant too, but not because people were getting sued. It's just like they, they, they got lame, you know? I was gonna buy this pair, but... Oh my god. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Dude, the picture that you sent me of the, the frozen honey... Uh-huh. That looks really inappropriate. I was like... It's oh. just... What? It's just frozen <laughs> honey. Yeah, but the, the thing in the background is like, oh. Cause cause like you look at the shape and it's like, oh okay. No, that's not no, what it's No, your for. brain just is you just not say so. Okay, fine, fine. <laughs> that's an adult Healy. But look at the Healy! Oh my that God. comes in adult sizes. What would you think if you saw just a random adult wearing these and gliding? Um, I would <laughs> This is this is like knowing that you want to purchase them, right? I just have to No, give through. me your honest uh, give me your honest opinion. <laughs> I would I would expect them to get seriously injured at some point in the next couple months and they would deserve it. They would deserve to get injured. <laughs> I would look at them, I'd be like, you're gonna you're gonna break an arm because of that, and you're gonna deserve it and you're never gonna use it ever again. How dangerous can it be? It's pretty dangerous. <laughs> Why? It's just a heel, and then you and then when you stop, you just put your, your foot down, right? It y while yes, but it's just like, have you never like tripped or lost your footing or, or like you're going, you know, uh -huh. or, or if you get bumped into, right? Like uh -huh. it's very easy to get knocked off your feet. It just is. <gasps> oh, maybe I shouldn't buy these. I trip on flat surfaces. Y yeah. Like if you, if you go to the Wikipedia and you look at it, like they got sued into oblivion <laughs> oh. for that. But it looks so cool though. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, I oh. take the loss. I I mistakenly <laughs> thought that these were never like they just did they just not I guess they're sold. So like I just made a mistake. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah, yeah. I I think I might lose <laughs> this one, but we're gonna continue. You're pulling we're no continue. punches. Yeah, we're gonna continue. Yeah. Okay. This one you might get. Okay. You might get. Okay. okay. Uh, you're gonna. It's a question of um, you have to choose the right answer. I have to. And then there's two options. If you get the right answer, I'll give you the I'll give you the point. And just as an extra, 
If you can tell me why the other answer is wrong, you get another point. What? How about that? This, so I, there's a chance for two points here. Okay, thank you. Thank yeah? You. All right, all right. Okay. All right. I'm in. Okay. <laughs> Hold on, I have to save it. Double point. I see, I see like what it is, <laughs> but I'm not like processing it. I'm just like yeah. okay, okay, adding okay. it. And then once I add it onto OBS, okay. then we'll, yeah. So <laughs> you're having a random conversation with a friend. Okay. Someone. And you type in lol, right? Yeah. How do you type in lol? Which is the correct way to type lol? The key point is like, it's a normal conversation. Yeah. <clears throat> Texting rules. Completely normal conversation. <laughs> For me, per okay, okay, hold on. Like, I have to guess first and then I can get a point. Like, it's just like 50% yeah. chance. Okay. Yeah, you got 50% chance. Which one is right? I mean... I can hear the gears in his brain. Yeah, yeah. I don't want to get this. I don't want to get this wrong because this is like. Ah. <laughs> it's technically you're like you're, you're giving me like an easy point, right? Yeah, I am. I wish I had more context for like normal conversation. Anything, actually, like any this this rule applies anywhere. Anywhere. Doesn't matter what kind of conversation you're having. I mean, all caps. Is that your answer? Yeah. Okay, that's correct. Yeah. Low in all caps is correct. Yeah. Now, for the second point, can you tell me why lowercase LOL is incorrect as texting etiquette goes? I mean, for me personally, if someone says that, it sounds like sarcastic to me. Mm-hmm. And it's just like, they don't, they don't actually think what you're saying is funny. They think you're funny. Like, you're not worth being taken seriously. Like, when they're saying it, you know, oh. low. Oh, that's, that's, uh, close. That's actually really close. Um, yes. So, okay. I got the one thing point, about, so it's fine. But I would you like you to come. Point. Yeah. It's, I mean, it's, it's pretty much there. Uh, so you might, I think you, you kind of think that it's the, the double point. It's kind of worth, uh, you kind of pretty much got it. Because lowercase, yeah. it's been shown that if you send LOL lowercase to someone, uh -huh. it comes off as passive aggressive. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Yeah. It's, yeah, so you pretty yeah. much got it. Yeah. Um, now, it's like sarcastic, you, right? Like low. Yeah. Yeah. And it also, if you use a lot of emojis or you write in lowercase LOL, it comes off as uh, passive aggressive. And more than once, and I know this because I am the test subject, if someone that I don't really know well uh -huh. slash someone that I, oh, well, just anyone, if they send me low, lowercase, yeah. if I don't know them as a person, I'll just assume that they're just not really part of the, they're not, focused on the conversation oh, or they're angry. Okay. Yeah, yeah, like yeah. They're yeah. angry at something. Yeah. It's like you say something and then their response is to laugh, but it's like a mirthless laughter, right? It's like, huh. Yep. Like that, that, yeah. Yep. And this is a very much Zoomer thing because I realized talking to others that they didn't know. They were like, what? Is that, that's the thing? But it's, capital, capitals doesn't do anything. What? Yeah. So this is a very Zoomer thing. Which is why I always type in low in uh, capital letters. Interesting. And yeah. Wait, let me ch let me check my phone to see like when I'm texting <laughs> other people. Like, am I am I insulting them? Let's just like check like family. Mhm. Mm oh no, I I do I do like the first letter is capitalized because it's like automatic, and then and then lower yeah, yeah. caps like other two. <laughs> um, that's kind of like in the middle. <laughs> what like are it's... these rules? It's like a it's like a thirty three point three three repeating like Yeah. That's kind of in the middle. Like it's I, I wouldn't get offended if you wrote that, but I also like that's a very normal response, I feel like. Okay. Like if you type lol if like if 
Oh, it's the thing if if I'm saying something funny, like if I'm telling a joke and uh-huh. you reply capital L O L, I know you're actually laughing. If yeah, you reply yeah, yeah, yeah. in all lowercase, it means you don't find me funny and that you're you I probably said something wrong. Um but if you do capital L lowercase O L, it's what? just like a normal response. That's That's the rule. I think for me like context is important because I've had people like lowercase L O L me when when uh-huh. I when they were mad at me, you know? Yeah. 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 But in normal conversation where it's like, it's clear that we're not like on bad terms. I've, I've gotten lowercase LOL and I haven't thought much about it, but oh no, I need to like, <laughs> you, you've like put this in my brain and now I'm going to be like, <laughs> uh oh, uh oh, <laughs> like, yeah. just to be safe. I'm just going to like caps it, like all caps it to like everybody just, that I talk to. Yeah. Yeah. Just yeah, to be yeah. safe. Unless yeah, it's somebody yeah. that I dislike. Then, yeah, then, then I'll hit him with the lower, lower, yeah, lower then case. Then I'll hit him with the the lower case. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. <laughs> I'm learning, but I, but yeah, okay. He's learning. <laughs> wait, wait, do I get the double point then? You do have, have with I, three three. Have I caught up? Oh. You've caught up with three three right now. Oh, thank you, thank you for your mercy. Uh huh. Okay. Um, Just senpai things. All right, I forgot. What's next? Am I on five or six? I don't remember. Six. Six. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Because you went first, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Six. And that was five, yeah. <laughs> I know what that is. Oh, you already I know, know what that is? is? Okay. Yeah, I know All what right. that is. All right. Is that the old window opener in cars? Yes. Like how you would open a yep. window. Yep, yep, yep. Yes! How do you know? Yes. How do you know? Like, did, 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 uh, do you know a car? I think my... Yeah, my... I think one of really early cars that I remember, I was like ultra baby though, mm-hmm. Um, uh, that my parents had had one of these nice <laughs> yes yes that's easy yes easy Thank one you very much. i was, that was uh... easy. <laughs> i'm not gonna lie i had to think for like a, a, a second yeah yeah <laughs> i had to think for a second but no i know what that is yes because you have to yes, keep yes, in mind yes. that even like in the year 2000 cars had switched over to power windows like you would only see uh-huh. a car that was equipped with something like this in like the mid 1990s like 1994 oh. five six and then i think 1997 onwards, like power windows became like a, a standard. Oh, yeah. But it does make sense that like, if you had like, if you had a memory of somebody that owned a yeah. car, like a really yeah. old car and they would have it, but yeah. like. I remember it was really, really old. Yeah, people used to have to roll oh. up their windows. That's that's why, yeah. that's the concept of rolling up a window, right? Wait, it is? Like, do, do you know that phrase? Like roll up the windows? Yeah. Is that where it comes from? It comes from this. Like, you used to have to roll up a window by hand instead of, like, pushing a button and then it goes up. Like, you're not rolling it up, right? <laughs> you just push a button and the window opens and closes. Like, instead of saying, like, open or close the windows, which would make sense <laughs> if it was always like that, you have to roll it up and down because of the roller. You know that meme where it's, like, a light bulb moment? Yeah! yeah. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I may have just had a light bulb moment that just connected... Oh, that's where it comes from. Oh, right. Okay. Uh, oh, I, I'm. <laughs> I underestimated it, Heiko Senpai. I feel like I should have. I should have busted out like the, the CAD stuff, like the computer, equi- like really obscure computer oh! equipment. My Uh-oh. original Uh-oh. list was just like, there's no way she's gonna know this because like not only is it from 1989. It's like 1989, and and you're like an architect. <laughs> so it's like there's no way, there's no way. Okay, all right. I, I might have to take the L here. Okay. Underestimated zoomers. I underestimated. May this be a lesson for yeah. you all. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Next. All right. I'm ready. Four three. Okay. Next is. <laughs> what do we got? <laughs> uh, what? <laughs> this is not. A... Okay, I I don't think I put this in because of any point. I just wanted to confuse you, and I'm also gonna. I'm not gonna lie. I think this is a regional thing. Uh, but I still wanted to show you anyway. So if if maybe I don't know how you would get a point, but <laughs> hold on. Okay, hold on a second. Hold on a second. Oh, my face hurts. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. <laughs> I know something related to this. Oh, you do? I know okay. something related to this, and I think. Okay, so is this like 
a meme. It's like a meme image meant to like make people laugh. And it's not like an actual thing. Give me three seconds. Um, so, so I'm going to talk to you about like what I know that's like seems to be related to this, but it's like, it's, okay. it's similar, but different. Okay. Have you ever heard of latte in a hole? It was a popular meme. Mm, no. Somebody, somebody took a picture, an image, right? Of like a muddy hole in the ground, right? And I think it was filled with dirt water, but it might've been coffee. It doesn't really matter. It's just like a brown liquid in a muddy hole in the ground. And you could see like grass, like along the side of it. And then they drew latte art. Like inside of a like a, oh, and, and it's not it's not meant to be anything but funny. It's just a meme I image. I see, I see. Yeah, is this like a meme? Like somebody did it on on Twitter or whatever as a joke, and it's just like, nope. look, it's a latte, and like you know, there's like a whole. Oh, okay, so damn it, I got it wrong. Okay. Nope. All right. It's an avocado latte. Do people actually eat it? You drink from it. They just use the avocado as a, the the. It's a cup. And you sell it. That's called an ava latte. <laughs> okay. Now I will give you the fact that I think it's a it's a, a Australian thing uh, that I discovered a couple years ago and. I, okay, if I'm being honest, I have the same reaction as you. I was like, there's no way this is real. But then it was real, and apparently it's normal, and it's um, quote-unquote quite hipster. And it's a thing. Do they eat the avocado afterwards? I don't think so. I think you just drink from it. So you because drink the latte you, and you throw the avocado away? No, no, like they, they scoop out the avocado and it's oh, just Oh, it's pot. the rind of the avocado? It's the rind with like a little bit of um like avocado on the sides. I don't know why this is a thing but what i can guess is you know how avocado is just really rich and creamy which is why they have like avocado milkshakes and stuff like that yeah they also have avocado ice cream i remember that was yeah thing. yeah and like avocado milkshakes are actually really nice because it doesn't taste like anything it's just it adds creaminess um to the milkshake itself you know so what i'm guessing which is it might be completely wrong but it adds like a sense of creaminess to the coffee what maybe like Coffee yeah. people are weird, man. This is why I drink tea. <laughs> Coffee hey! people are weird, no! man. Hey, 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 <laughs> hey, 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 hey. Yo, not disrespecting the coffee. Hey, no, 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 no. I'll take the L. All right, hold on. Can, can I? Can you let me verify? Can you let me verify yeah. that this is a thing that people used to actually purchased? They spent money. Avo latte. Yeah. No way, people. <laughs> I hate this <laughs> on every uh, on every level. I yeah, there is avocado, like actual <laughs> avocado in there. Mhm. Mm and there's a spoon, so I think it's expected that you eat the avocado like part. <laughs> I'm not surprised. Have you have like, you have you eaten this? No, I haven't actually. I actually really want to try. <laughs> this is just this is just like an abomination. What? <laughs> hey, what if what if it tastes good? You never know. Well, I mean, avocado, like, I like avocado. Some people really hate it, but I, I do like the taste of avocado. I think it's, like, really... Uh -huh. It's got... I like it. It's got a really rich flavor, like a buttery yeah. flavor that I like. I am, like, kind of a traditionalist. I don't like... I don't like mixing flavors, you know? Oh, okay. Yeah, so, like, I avocado has its place, and then coffee... I like coffee. Coffee has its place, and, like, they, they, they're, like, mutually exclusive. So, for me, this is just, like... Wrong. <laughs> <laughs> All right, people. People actually pay for it, and they're a cap. Yeah, okay, I lose. It's a delicacy. <laughs> you know, if you if you order one of these, I'm pretty sure you're considered very cool. Oh my god, I don't want to be cool. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Okay, okay. Uh, number it's seven. Four three. Okay. Yeah, number seven. I'm down. Okay. Is this not a thing? No. It's, it isn't. It should not. Oh. What is it? Uh, I just, didn't you plug this into the TV? Yes. I don't know what it does, but I just know you- What is it, it connected to? <laughs> no, I don't know. I actually don't know. Uh, <laughs> I just know you plug it into the TV. <laughs> um, 
What are you plugging to a TV? Um, well, it requires more explanation than that. Oh. Because if you if you go to look at like, I'm pretty sure you have a television, and if you look behind it, it wouldn't have these anymore. Oh. What are you plugging to a TV? <laughs> no, that's I got nothing. I just know you plug it into the TV. <laughs> Because okay. I remember, like, the very, uh, when I was younger, we, uh, the TV that we had. I swear my TV now still has. Don't you have, wait, this is not a thing now? You sure? Pretty sure it shouldn't. I mean, I actually oh. checked. I actually checked. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, okay, maybe it was just the old TV then. Yeah, yeah, I just saw these coming out of the side. Yeah. I don't know what it connects so, so to. So you have, you have the context that, like, this was for older TVs, right? Okay. Do you... Do you know, like, the con- It requires a little bit of, like, knowing about tech, but not too much. Just a little bit. Oh, it did something connects to it, right? Do I have to guess what that something is? Um, uh, I think there's, like, a keyword that I'm looking for. Specifically. Tables. <laughs> like, a keyword is, like, this- This thing that, like, when I say it, you'll be like, Oh, yeah, I know that. Like, everybody knows this phrase, right? <laughs> I guess it's a little bit mysterious, but when I say it, you'll be like, oh yeah, I know that. Like, everybody knows this phrase. <laughs> everybody knows it. I don't know it. I just know, like, I, I, I don't know what it connects. I just know okay. it connects to a TV. Okay, so... Okay, I'll just say it. HD. Do you know what HD is? High definition. Yes. You know that, like, TVs weren't always... All right, do you know what the HD aspect ratio is? 16 by 9? Yes, 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 yes. And, and like, if you've seen an older TV, you know that they're not 16 by 9, right? Yeah, they're, like, more square-like. It was a 4 by 3 aspect ratio, right? Okay. These are, these are, like, RCA cables. They're, like, analog cables. And, like, everything used to be connected like this. And it was like that for 40 or 50 years. And then when HD came along, which is, like, an analog, like... Not analog. Uh, it's a it's a digital system. Like they switched away from this, but like <laughs> everything, like VCRs, like anything that connected to a TV had to be connected like through these RCA cables. Like, and then when things became high def, high definition, like HDMI, right? HD, HDMI. Like, <laughs> is that what HD stands for? In HDMI? I think so. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Okay. So, so game consoles, VCRs, like everything that was connected to an analog, like television. Uh huh. Four by three aspect ratio used these three cables. Like, do you, do you, did you ever have like a Super Nintendo, PlayStation? Playstations were like that. PlayStation Two was the first one that was like kind of HD, but not really. Like, didn't really need to. No. And then, okay. <laughs> I said this before, but I don't know what. I, I, I didn't. I never had consoles growing up so i don't know oh i actually didn't know that <laughs> yeah i did, if i'm being like completely honest like, i know i heard the name before but i don't know what a nintendo 64 and i don't know what the buzz around it is interesting i don't know what it yeah i don't know what it looks like um <laughs> but you did know so that what, it's yeah. something that's being connected to a tv i guess that no 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 no, no, no. that doesn't count i mean you can plug anything into a tv i guess <laughs> so <laughs> No, nah, I don't think I get the point on that. Yeah. What did um, you remember it from? Like, do you, 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 do you remember like a four by three aspect ratio, like a CRT television? Yeah! Like, that's like big and chunky and it's not flat? Yeah! No yeah, way. yeah, yeah, yeah. What the I remember heck? when I, when I was really, 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 really young. Um, yeah. Interesting. And then I think because I was just really curious, because if something didn't work, um, yeah. Papa Rat or Dad was the only one who would be just fix, trying to fix it. And yeah. he would like, yeah. I just remember I was walking into the living room as baby, baby bay, and I was just so confused. And then I think I distinctively remember that there were just always these three cables coming out from the yes. side. Yeah. So probably and like then a the VCR. Yellow went into the yellow. Yeah. What's a VCR? Do you, do you actually not know what a VCR is? I should have added a VCR. Damn it. <laughs> what, what's a VCR? Um, before DVDs, like the CDs. You mean VHS? Yeah, VHS. Yeah. What's VHS? Wait, what? Oh, Isn't you're right. VC VCR is the recording thing. Like, you used to have, like, these, like, cameras, and then, like, you could put in a whole tape and then record. Yeah, it's it's VCR. Like, the, the R in VCR is recording. My bad. <laughs> oh! 
Oh, yeah, yeah, I always yeah. heard you could record. I never knew how to do it though. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> right, 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 right. Okay, we're winding up. <laughs> okay. We got one each. I think I'm. Are we even? No, we have two we more. We have two, two more? more. Yeah, two more. <clears throat> one each. Uh, though, we're still right? at four, three, I think. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> you actually might get this one. Okay. You, uh, yeah. Okay. You, you might get this one. I. This is the one that I need to send you a video of. Yeah, yeah, yeah. After. What? Oh, you don't know this one? Yeah, let's oh, go. Oh no. Let's go. Easy win. Oh no, I think I lost this one. Uh -oh. Easy win. I don't get the video, right? I have to know what it is. Not yet. Just based on this. Okay. Then I think I lost. Um. <laughs> hmm. I'll. Mm. Hit, oh, hit the whoa! <laughs> hit the whoa! Hey, Vesper, can you hit the whoa? Hit the whoa! <laughs> and it's spelled like that because that's not the right that you spell like the whoa that I know. Hit the whoa! <laughs> Usually the H is between the the W and the O. Whoa! <laughs> what? Hit the whoa! Is, all right, so I'm just gonna have to guess because I actually have no context for this. I don't know. Uh -huh. Does it mean drinking water? What? I don't know. Where, where do you get water from? Is it the woe? Woe is like water, and then hitting like because because when you hit when you hit something, it's like you're drinking. It's like a drinking thing. It's a drinking term. Uh -huh. Like you're hitting the bottle. Oh my God. I don't know. Oh, I'm embarrassed. <gasps> No, tell me! It's, it's, <laughs> I mean, you said you know, you didn't know what tick, the, like you didn't really understand TikTok culture and stuff. At like all, that. like not even yeah. a little bit. Okay, tell yeah. me what it is. Um, hit the wall is a is a dance. It's it's like flossing a dance. Hit the wall <sighs> it's is a dance. Always too. a dance. I can't keep up with these dance. Okay, so okay. Okay, I will send oh, you a video. I, this is the one that I have to mute my my audio, right? Mute your yeah. Okay, so so. Heiko Senpai is not going to be able to talk because it, it's yeah. I'm using yeah. Okay. Yeah, um, so that's okay. I'm, okay, so I'm gonna mute you right now. She is muted, and now I can go look at the video. There we go. Three minutes of people hitting the woe. Uh-oh. What? How am I supposed to know that? <laughs> What the fuck? I hate this. I hate this. I Oh, now it's like old people hitting the woad. No! 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 Have some dignity! Come on! What are you doing? What are you doing? I'm done! I'm done! I'm not gonna watch the rest of this video. Get out of here! Why are all. It's just a dance, or is there a story behind it, or is it just a de it's a stupid, nonsensical dance, and then like they just named they just named it hitting the woe for no reason. Oh, you're still Whoa. muted. Oh my god, I'm sorry. Oh, oh it's okay. <laughs> I was just dying in the background. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'm sorry. I I forgot to unmute. It's okay. Oh. It's okay. No, so I was I, just yeah. saying, um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. Uh, so, Hit the Wall, I don't really know how, how it started. It okay. just started on TikTok. And I actually didn't learn it through TikTok. Okay. Um, this was a couple years ago. For some reason, everyone in my, in my dance circle just started doing this one move. <sighs> and it, pretty much it would be like, you're, you're trying... To, you, you would pretend to throw something in the air, yeah. and the other person would pretend to catch it, and then I hit the wall. And you didn't see that, but I just did it um, on uh, instinctively. Oh I'm sorry. Did you see that? I'll do it again. So you throw something in the air, and then you catch it, and then you 
hit the wall. <laughs> I see it. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, your body moved, yeah, okay. <laughs> um, yeah, so I didn't realize it was a TikTok trend thing until a couple years later. I was just using that with my dance friends because I thought it was just like a, a new thing that we just did. And I was like, okay, cool. Um, but then I found out it was a TikTok trend and then it felt less cool. Um, <sighs> so I stopped doing it. <laughs> yeah. I was, because you know? the thing is like, if it's like young people, because it's mostly like, they look pretty young. And I was like, right. yeah, I don't understand it, but I'm not going to look down on them. Of course, like, you know, like when I was a, when I was a kid, like we did stuff like that. And it was just like, oh, it's cool. Like, you know, dances that were popular and stuff like that. This is like mm -hmm. old people doing it. And like, my soul just <laughs> recoiled. And it's like, you should be ashamed of yourselves. Go do your taxes. Like, what is wrong with you? What is wrong with Yo, you? Everybody <laughs> can enjoy the woe. What's wrong with old people doing the woe? I am, I am anti-woe. <laughs> Till the day that I die, I'm anti woe. No, no, I'm gonna make you not. hit the wall when you get a 3D. <laughs> we could change that to my punishment because I think I'm gonna lose this one for sure. <laughs> you, that punishment is, you know, whenever you get the your tweet? 3D, you gotta you got hit the wall. We, we're gonna do like the tweet stuff, right? Like, but like, if yeah, you, yeah, cause yeah. I'm like almost, cause, cause you. Well, let's just do the last one. Like, let's just get it over with, right? Okay, okay, okay. My last one is not an image. It's an audio. Oh. It's an audio oh! thing. Oh! Don't worry, I already forgot. You, it kind of leaked at the beginning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It leaked heard, a okay. So it's okay. Okay. Um, I think you'll be able to hear it. Can you hear my... my Because it's going to be on OBS. I don't know if you'll be able to hear it. <laughs> oh, okay. Might have to do something weird and like you'll you'll like un like I mean, watch I can just my stream. Turn on the stream real quick. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe you should switch like stream, stream mode. Real quick. Yeah, yeah. So okay, mute, okay. mute me. Yeah, and then and then just like listen to it through the stream. Okay. Okay. Let me know when you're ready, and then I'll go ahead. I'm ready. Okay. Here we go. Why is it so long? What the heck? Okay. And what then, the? do you, do you know what that is? Why was it so long? So you Wait, know what, what it is. You know what it is. It's just a little bit too long. Like you're like it's. Why? No, well, like the obviously the first part was I the, 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 that's still a thing where you dial a phone number, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I don't know what the rest of the sounds are. Was it oh, like so you don't know. <gasps> What? We have a chance. <laughs> what? That's a very specific thing. And when I tell what? you about it, when I tell you about the lore, I think we have a chance. Yeah, yeah. It's not a phone. It's not like if you Wait, say it's not it, a phone. It's not a. It's it's something. It's it's not a phone. I'm gonna tell you what, what? it is. And and then you'll okay. understand. What? It's, no, it's okay, so, tangentially uh, oh. related to a phone, but it, you're not using a phone. It's not a phone. What? Then how do you dial? What? That was, di that was definitely a dial sound. Yes. Because you heard the numbers at the front. Okay. Besties, we have a chance. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Do I still lose even if you don't get this? Like, or are we tied? Well, I like, still have one more. You have one more? This is my I eighth one. I have eight. Yeah, yeah, I... yeah, but you started first. Oh, crap. Okay. Yeah, yeah. okay. So I need to get yeah. the next. Okay, dang it. Okay, all right. Okay, maybe for the last two, it's if I don't get it, you get a point. No, 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 no. We'll, we'll, we'll play it the no? way it is. Yeah, like, but okay, I think okay. I think I got this one because you just don't know what it is. And I, I don't know what it is. It. So yeah. you, you give up and you don't know what it is? I, 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 don't, I okay. don't know what it is. <laughs> have you ever had dial up internet? Have you ever heard that phrase? No. You've never heard it. So you've only had broadband internet, like DSL, What's cable. What's broadband? Cable? What's that? Okay. Like, what? Isn't it Wi-Fi? Fast internet. You've only ever had oh. fast internet. Sure. Okay. In the infancy of the internet, when people were still getting into it, there was only dial-up. Like, there was broadband internet, but only companies had access to it. It was called, like, T... It's like... It's, I don't want to get into it. It's, like, very... Whatever. But the point is, like, if you were an end user and you wanted to use the internet, you had to use something called 56K, 56 kilobit internet, right? It's dial-up. And how it worked was you had to connect... You had to have a 56K modem in your computer, 
and then you used a telephone cable to connect the modem to the telephone plug in the wall, right? And then you would use the internet through that. <laughs> and it was extremely slow and unstable. And when you wanted to connect to the internet, you basically had to tell your computer to make quote unquote a phone call and it would make that noise to, to boot up your modem and connect you to the internet. And on top of that, because you were using the phone line in your house, if somebody picked up the phone to, to call someone, those couldn't interact together. So you would get kicked off the internet. <laughs> It's You're called telling me people use the internet through their phone line. Yeah, their phone line. It was called dial up internet and it was called, yeah, a 56k modem. <laughs> and How every does time you have internet, huh? How the phone, does phone doesn't have, have internet. internet. No, no, it's, it's not connected to any phone. It's connected to the phone outlet, the plug in the wall that you plug a phone into. Right. And, and there's Isn't no phone. Is that just a PowerPoint plug? No, no, <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't, I don't, I don't know much about like the phone cable because like that type of tech was before my time. But I do specifically remember that you had to get, you had to get a dial-up modem, like a 56k modem, install it into the PCI slot on your PC, and then you plug in the telephone cable into your computer. It's not, there's no phone anywhere in there. And then when you logged onto the internet, you had to log onto the internet. You weren't always connected to the internet. Like you had to like. Well, you have to log. Wait, isn't that just logging? Like you have like. A, no, like no, no. You were not connected what? to the internet, and then you had to use like a service. Like the most common one was AOL. It was really bad, and then there was a free one called Netscape. But both of them used 56k, and then like you were not on the internet on your computer, and then you logged on to, for example, AOL. You wouldn't know AOL because that's America, America Online. Like Netscape, we'll use like Netscape, right? And it would make that noise. <laughs> it always that's the trademark noise of logging on to the internet. <laughs> <laughs> it's dial up okay. internet yeah dial up in but that wait oh what that let it wait oh. <laughs> i'm so confused yeah Yay. yeah 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 what <laughs> how do you connect your pc to the it required it required like you had to buy it <laughs> You had to buy a PCI card, which was like a 56k modem, and then and then install it into your PC, and then you had to connect it, and then you had to have a service that would connect you. Where I lived, AOL was the main one, and then. How do you make a phone call from the PC? Do you type the number in the it's, keypad? No, no, no. It's not a phone call. You would just log on to your AOL account, and then AOL would be like, "Okay, this person wants to use the internet. Let's run it through the modem." The modem would boot up, and it would make that noise. That was the that was the boot up noise for your modem. And then once it was done with that, it would connect you to the internet, and then boom, you're on the internet. <laughs> and then you would have to log off. So, so when it, when you started up your computers, you weren't automatically connected to the internet. You would have to, you would have to, yeah. Oh. Oh. And it was very slow. It was in, like, I can't even describe how <laughs> slow it was. I see. Yeah. Cool. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so this is it. I'm so confused. Okay. <laughs> Please don't be another dance. I beg you. <laughs> There's just no way. I saved the best for last. Okay, hit, it, hit me with it. So this is like, if I lose it, I lose. Hitting the woe. Oh my god. Disgusting. <laughs> send it, send it, just end it. What? You made... You made Zeta Senpai draw this? I've never heard of this, but I guess I just have to guess, right? It is clearly a butt. 
<laughs> it is very clearly a butt, and it's glittery. Yes. Yes, I can see that. I don't know what it is. Like I've never, I've never seen a glitter butt. It's just a fashion. It, people like to do. So glitter butt. I mean, I don't know what it is, and it's like if it's just it is what it is. It's a glittery butt, and people thought it looked cool. I, I think I just have to take the L because like I've never seen it before. Like I don't. And you know what? I think you get a point because that's exactly what it is. That is so stupid. That is so incredibly stupid. What? It looks even stupider in real life. I mean, you got it. So this was back in 2018 where every, just the internet exploded and everybody was just glitterifying their butt cheeks. It was mainly like a TikTok slash Instagram thing. Okay. Yeah. It exploded! It did! It was a very, very popular trend, and people would just glitterify the, the butt. G glitter, glitter butt. I have a, I have a question, Heiko Senpai. Uh huh. How was I expected to get this wrong? <laughs> I mean, I just wanted to see your reaction. <laughs> Because I don't think you knew this was a thing. I didn't know this was a thing, but like, I can't think of a context where it's not exactly what it is. Like, people are putting glitter on their butt and they're walking around with it, and people are like, Yeah. Oh, it's glittery. But well, I just, I just wanted to see your reaction to you just, Zuma you just... fashion trends. So there was no, there was no like intent to stump me. It just is what it is. I have stumped you, haven't I? I mean, I know. <laughs> Why are you showing me pictures of this? Isn't it beautiful? It's no. Good, it's like. Not. <laughs> what? The heck? what? <sighs> oh my god, my cheeks hurt. Oh, oh my god. Oh. Oh. one where it's like a pumpkin come yeah! on no no and then you can like get really creative with it and it's, it's, it's amazing you put like rhinestones look at this one please don't show me anymore please please <laughs> i'll take the loss i'd rather take please don't show me another one and i'll take the loss <laughs> you showed me another one come on man come on <laughs> oh my god um i think this is mainly for for festivals slash raves or something. I yeah, don't really know. Okay, yeah. But welcome to Zuma Culture. <laughs> I hate this. I just <laughs> I just hate that. And just so you know, I've never done this before. I just want to put that out there. Okay. I've never I've never had a glitter butt. That doesn't change my opinion of you. <laughs> <laughs> What is it? <sighs> okay, so does this count as a loss or a win? Like, are, are we even or, or did I lose by one? Like, I think we're even. We're even? Okay. We, we're, mm. What? <laughs> Nobody wins! It's a tie. I, mean, I feel like I've lost. <laughs> I feel like <laughs> just... <laughs> I gained like way too much cursed knowledge. All right, what was cursed? <laughs> Glitter butts is like the worst for sure. Is good. Uh, the hitting worst? the wall okay. was frustrating, but like, I think Avo Latte hit did emotional damage more emotional damage. Avo Latte did more. Hitting the wall was frustrating, uh -huh. but uh -huh. it, it's not cursed. It's just I mean dance like kids do dances, yeah. right? Yeah, Avo Latte yeah, yeah. did emotional damage. <laughs> Frozen honey was pretty bad. 
See, you, this is, you know it's bad where like, I just feel like I've learned more. I feel more educated. Okay. I have gained brain cells, but okay. I feel like I Grant lost, has lost I brain lost, cells. I lost a significant amount of brain cells. Oh my God. <laughs> Please delete the images. <laughs> I'm begging you. I don't want to no. look at them. I don't want to look at them anymore. <laughs> I don't want to look at them anymore, please. Can I hide messages? <laughs> I can't. Oh. Okay, I guess we're I guess we're even. Thank you for I guess thank you for doing this collab. Oh my god. <sighs> oh! Was... oh my god! This is... Oh! What? Oh my god! What? Oh my god! What? 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 I'm sorry. No! Oh, come on, I'm closing Discord. <laughs> no. Okay, okay, we're ending I'm we're ending sorry. the stream. Okay, thank <laughs> you for thank you for coming everybody. I think I think we ran a little bit over and Dez is doing a, a, a an art stream. I really want to go check him out. Maybe I could cleanse my brain cells just by watching him Heiko Senpai. Thank you for having me. This is fun. You dealt like maximum psychic damage to me. <laughs> You're like a Mewtwo doing like psychic and just like oh, oh the okay. pain that's <laughs> just in agony i am in extreme pain right now but <laughs> it was fun it was good it was fun yeah yeah thank yeah. you so much for <laughs> teaching me about the past i feel educated yeah um, i hope you feel i don't know how do you feel about living in the current i need to hide glitter butts we're hiding it okay <laughs> oh no how do you feel about the current state of time in this current state of society that we live in i just want to find a nice big comfy rock and just <laughs> slither underneath it and then never appear ever again never like reappear ever again and then, oh. Oh. well My face hurts <laughs> I had fun? Question mark. I, I think I had fun. I think I, I had fun. I had fun. It's just. Yeah, you, you sure about that? Yeah, it's just, you definitely saved the most impactful one for the end. Yeah, it was great. The avo latte kind of pissed me off, but it's like you know what? Like whatever. Like you should okay. try avo latte. No. Homemade avo latte. No, I, I don't think I. I don't think I will. Thank you. But anyways, okay. we're gonna send everybody over to Des. Everybody, thank you for okay. watching. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I guess it, I guess it was a draw. Yeah, take care, everybody. It was a draw. Yeah. Zuma. Um, if you ever get a 3D, though, you have to hit the wall. Please. You know what? Please. As, because I I feel like I lost. I feel like if not by the straight numbers, just like psychologically, I took the loss <laughs> for this one in this battle. I lost. Uh -huh, uh -huh. It might take a while, right? I mean, like, not to not to say too much, but like, it, it does. It might take a couple years. Like, I know, I know about the stars, like, and stuff like that. It might. Well, we never know when it comes to them, but it will happen. Yeah, yeah. Eventually. What, what, it'll it'll eventually happen that we will get three Ds, right? Mm -hmm. And when it does, I will remember to do, to hit the wall as a as a sign that I've like lost this battle. Like, I lost this battle, <laughs> if not by numbers, just by. Just by the sheer amount of emotional and mental damage that I took. Because I don't think you took any mental damage. You're just kind of... You're just kind of <laughs> zooming, right? Like... <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll hit the woe when when I get... Because it's, it's a matter of when. Like, when I get my model, yeah. 3D model, yes, I will hit the woe. I promise that. Okay. Uh, okay, thank you, Hiko. Okay, thank goodbye, you so everybody. Much. Yep, take care. Bye! Hooray!